I know why I don't play. Really? Already? That was so fast. <laughs> that was so fast. <laughs> now play with the other one. Whoa. Oh, it's a whole different wish. Well, Dick, here's the deal. I'm the best there is, plain and simple. Well, I mean, I wake up in the morning, I piss excellence. Thank you. And nobody can hang with my stuff. Just a, just a big, hairy American winning machine. If you ain't first, you're last. Nope. Hello, I'm Jensen. What's going on, everybody? Hope you're having a great day. If you're new to the channel, make sure you like and subscribe. So as you can see, we are here at Broadway Auto Sound. Bro's about to help me fix the subs real quick, get them slapping again. And then after that, we're going to finally put subs and then the touchscreen in the BMW. Because last week, he put all new door speakers in that thing. So put some subs in it, get the slapping, and then finally get this thing back slapping because I don't know what's wrong with it. But check what's around the corner. This motherfucker, man. Shoo -hoo -hoo. You got the mustard mayo things on there, so that's damn near exactly what I want, except gold spokes, gold nipples. What size do you think they're These are probably 20s. Hmm. Wow. That shit bent like Got a classic hat collection to go with the car. For real, though. Clean. He clean. I wonder what year this is. It's hella funny. Two cutties. I like the two door better. Yeah, I do. But the four door is still clean. Definitely. For sure, for sure. That grill goes crazy. I'm not gonna lie. Wow. I like the new headlights. These were the headlights I was looking at too. Definitely get those. Those look hella good. We got a couple projects in here right now. The Roush. The Roush charge 5.0. Okay. And then that Mustang from last time with the mustard mayonnaise on them. Can't really see, but this is the Mustang they were putting the Tesla dash in. Oh wow. That's amazing. Oh my God. No shit. The speakers can't do that, but I know why I don't play. Really? Already? That was so fast. <laughs> Off That was so fast. <laughs> that boy popped the trunk and knew immediately. You do them. Hey, feel this. Now play with the other one. Whoa. So this is a good ass amp. Yeah. But these speakers are only 500 watts each. So you're doing like a thousand but maybe 800 on a good note, the amp will do all 15. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So it's this would be perfect to the 15s that you got. So uh, Damn, I should've brought the 15. You probably got power, you probably got everything, you just ain't got no boom boom. Yeah. So yeah, uh, that's what I'll pull it in, yeah. But you already know what's going on. Yeah. <laughs> Hell yeah. Damn, I figured that shit out so fast. I mean, we still gotta clean you up. The amp shouldn't be, basically, inside amplifiers you got something called resistors and transistors mm -hmm. so if you got a 1500 watt amp maybe for the first six months you do mm -hmm. after six months you're shaking the shit out that amp which oh. means you're shaking your watts away yeah. 
So okay. why force the amp to to shake? So That's we true. put the amps on boards and separate from the actual sub. You know what I mean? Okay. But um, don't get me wrong. It's easy to hook it up and you know real quick and yeah, put it right to, there. It's all together. You know what I mean? But other than that, uh, in the end, it looks okay. But you wanna you wanna look at the battery yeah, connection? Uh, pop the uh, pop the. That shit is funny looking. Excuse me, bro. I think Maria was in this thing, man. Mexico. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. Yeah, look at all this. I mean, I get it, <laughs> but this is what um, it's okay spaghetti, but we could clean it up. And, yeah. Uh, so this this amp or the fuse. This one blew. probably is gonna keep blowing because um, what did you have running it? A hundred. Yep. Remember, you got a fifteen hundred watt amp. So the wattage go by the um the ampage. So. If you got a 100 watt amp, that's up to a thousand watts. Hmm. You're pushing a 1500 watt amp, nothing but time is in between you to blow that. So okay. So what, what you put in here now? 150. So it's gonna handle it, but the amp does 15. So hmm. you should always do like more. You know what I mean? But so what? What should be there? I would do like a 250 or a 250? 300. Wow. Okay. Yeah. Later this on, this one's a two, I think. Right. Later on, you're gonna end up eventually doing a second battery. Hmm. Batteries can't talk to each other with regular fuses. They gotta okay. be top of the line 300 amps you know what i mean 350s hmm. um this is cool right here because um he tried to do what he could to stop the headlights from blinking because yeah. remember say you didn't have bass then that mean the original wire from the alternator is okay it starts the car and it runs it yeah but when you start moving that bass it's pulling that current which means you gotta upgrade the wire so he upgraded this wire this is one he upgraded this wire because you see the factory ground yeah yeah this is this is just to get the standards to start the car you know what i mean okay. but once you start pumping that base if 80 year old lady had the same car she got the same wires so mm -hmm. you have to upgrade all these wires to try to produce more but we're gonna take all this away and clean it up more we're gonna put zero gauge because this is four gauge for sure this yeah I, cool, I still got some at the house too yeah. you could probably reuse a little bit now, i'm gonna use all brand new stuff okay so for sure pull you up and is there any that is way it ain't you don't want to see the colors, you know what I mean? You want everything in the loom. Yeah, tucked away and stuff. So we don't clean it up and, uh, Is there anything to do to get slapping today? Um, we need subs. So, uh, and other than that, uh, let's but let's make sure you uh you got everything that's required for the amp. I want to make sure you got the power, the accessory, the ground. For sure. And then go from there. But just pop in the trunk. I already smell fire. Really? So the, what happens is negative can't touch positive. So mm -hmm. the moment the speaker is cooking. It's, run, it's walking down the street with no water. You know what I mean? It okay. just has nothing to do but blow. That makes so sense. If one sub is bad and they're both connected to the same box, to mm -hmm. the same amp, one sub makes both subs bad. So you probably got one good sub, but the other one is already defeated. Huh. So we're going we're gonna to see what's going on back there. But, uh, For sure. Just from off top, I already know you kind of blew. <laughs> we're going to see what we can do right now. For sure. Thank you, bro. This is all good. That's how you... Uh, how you fill this puppy in and uh, you know, uh that one's next yeah for sure uh, let me try to make the room there's <laughs> <laughs> a negative so remember these are sharing wires to get to one terminal yeah, so uh, that one the right moment there. Negative touches positive, pop, protection. That's probably what blew your fuse to begin with. Hmm. And then, just to even try something. Oh my God. <laughs> Damn. So we already know the issue, you know yeah. what I mean? But uh, nothing but time does it. These are cool, but this is made for a different type of amp. Hmm. And that means you're probably going a good two hours strong, you know what I mean? So. <laughs> Sheesh. Yeah, I would have never even guessed I blew these out. I had them for like a week. <laughs> Literally. You gotta right. be a certain size to do this. <laughs> so as you can see, you could fit plenty of bodies in this trunk. <laughs> but he's taking the amp off right now. Get these subs out because they're blown. Throw some new fuses in there. Get to slapping. Now I was gonna ask you about this brand. So needle mask is good. Uh, it's a Concord thing. Yeah, so, really? Uh, amplifiers, so needle mask. When you see that alien, mm -hmm. it's a underrated.
company, but what most people don't know about Sennado Mask, it's made in Korea. Hmm. So Korean boards are the dopest boards. They're made out of gold. So they really? handle heat better, they do different things. So okay. it's just underrated. That's dope. Something most people ain't heard of, but I heard about them, like I heard about Scar Audio. Scar Audio is a pretty dope brand. I've heard about them too, and, yeah. Um, they've been out just as long, but um, you can't fuck with Scar. Scar is, you pay for them. Mm -hmm. $900 for one speaker, you know what I mean? Like, Damn. It can get wild, depending on the budget. But that's dope, that's a good amp then. But it's this thing right here, if you had like two yellow top Optimus, mm -hmm. one in the front, one in the back, this thing would push maybe 2,000 watts to continuous because every time your baseline hits, your battery meter can twitch. Yeah. So like that, you never you never really get the full power. Mm -hmm. And then, you know what I mean? Yeah, I, I noticed right like... This right here is cool, but this is a no bueno. The you ground know, right there? You know, the ground is. <laughs> Yeah, I noticed when I would turn it up, the subs would get weaker and weaker and weaker. Because you just, uh, it's like you just whispering in a club. You know what I mean? Good luck. That makes yeah. sense. That makes sense. <laughs> yeah, there's so much room in here. God. Stripping it. Got that back seat out in like three seconds. Sheesh. Putting in work. That's what I want to see. So he already moved the ground right there, tucked the wires right there, already making it look way better than before. It's been like five minutes. Yeah, we've been here for like five minutes. It's crazy. Bro's in here hiding all those wires, making it all nice and neat. Damn, so that's what you were doing back there, huh? Creating a hole. Creating a whole board for us. The master. You be working so fast too, that shit's crazy. You guys do window tents too, right? Yeah. I might have you do this thing when I drop it off for a week. Dude, my dude, he, in, uh, he on vacation right now. Okay. But back with time. What's your opinion? You guys think I should tint this? Because I know a lot of people leave Cullis's fishbowl, yeah. but I don't know. I mean, I would just say expect the police. Yeah. yeah. The moment you do it. I mean, I already get hella tent tickets I mean, with out, the Hellcat. Out so here, like, maybe not, but you cross that bridge. Yeah. Right. yeah. Be so on my you, ass. You on the wait way all the time? Sheesh. <laughs> So yeah, I don't know, maybe. I want to, but I, I know a lot of people leave in Fishbowl. And I'm not sure if I've mentioned this before, but Broadway Auto Sound's been here for 27 years. That looks so much better though. 10 times better. 10 times better. And there's gonna be another amp and another battery on that's what all the extra room is. Wow. And then all of this. It's gonna be carpet later. And then we're gonna wall this off, wall that off, light it all up. It's gonna be crazy, bro. Ooh, yeah, even this, like. Just changes everything, you know what I mean? Like, makes it look so much more neat and tidy, like. You can see if something's going wrong, you can check everything cleaner. Yeah. You're not shaking the shit out the amps, you know what I mean? But, um, base is meant to shake, but why do it on purpose, you know what I mean? So. Yeah. Try to protect that amp a little bit. And if you ever seen a see-through amp, you'd be like, there's so much little shit that's soldered in there, you can mm. just screw it right to the box and shake it loose. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. You got your keys, right? I think they're in the ignition. Good. Uh, let's uh, move this uh, out here for a minute, and uh, we're gonna pull this big van out. And so they're pulling one of the trucks out, pull the cutlasses out. They look so good next to each other. Yeah. 
I need some of these wheels. I gotta get rid of the dinner plates. We got the two door and we got the four door. I don't know, I kinda like the, the two door a little better. They both look really good though. I just need to get my top done. That shit looks crazy. Damn, okay, so they just brought some shit out. <laughs> <laughs> Truck, huh? Doing it right. All right, so these are Kicker Comp Q15s. Putting them in a ported 15-inch box. I like your style. You don't play around. Oh, no. <laughs> like I don't see nobody. <laughs> <laughs> well, you gotta treat the car like it was yours. If if you treat the car like it's yours, you won't have no issues. Very true, very true. I like that. You know the uh, connector? Making everything super clean. Went to grab some Chick-fil-A real quick. They're over here making moves. Got the 15s in there. Sheesh. You got the keys going? Yeah. And it closed. Fit perfect. Everything hooked up. He's in there tuning it. Because he knows what he's doing. I don't know what I'm doing. They installed the base knob too. Wait. So they just finished the cut list. This thing sounds like a completely different car. The amount of sub power that the 15s have in this brand compared to the 212s over there, the two Memphis 12s is ridiculous. Like it, it's hard to even compare because you can't compare it. Huge, huge shout out to Broadway Auto Sound. Thank you very much for hooking me up. I really appreciate it. If you guys need any audio work, tent, just any crazy custom stuff that you, you have an idea of, make sure you come here because they can get it done and they'll do quality work too. They're not gonna cut corners and try and find the cheap way out. They're gonna they're gonna get it done right. Yeah, and they just had a Rolls Royce cooling in here yesterday. So whatever kind of car you have from an old school, new Mustang, anything, anything, old truck. Here, let me show you what they're doing to this truck. Yeah, yeah. If you need anything done electrical, come here because I wouldn't even know where to start, but bro knows exactly what he's doing. So we got the cutlass all done. Stay tuned for the next video because we're doing something to the, the 328i. So stay tuned for that. But that's going to be the end of this video. Thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment, share, hit the bell, thumbs up, all that stuff. Go down below to helloclothing.com. Grab your merch. Subscribe to the OnlyFans to get those driving tutorials. Make sure you go follow Broadway Auto Sound on Instagram. Check out all their projects that they work on. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Doses.